When you sign up for Google Workspace, you get email addresses that use your domain. So if your company owns the domain name solarmora.com, you get email addresses that use at solarmora.com. You can also set up team mailing lists that use your domain name. Messages to users in the mailing list arrive in each person's Google Workspace mailbox. There are two ways to use another domain with Google Workspace, and we'll show you how to choose the option that fits your business. Let's say your team owns the domains solarmora.com and other-company.net, and your team manages businesses for both domains. You and your users can send and receive emails using addresses from both domains. As the administrator, you can set up a domain alias to give every user another email using other-company.net. There's no additional cost for adding or using a user alias domain in your Google Workspace account. User alias domain features. Good for one team that manages multiple businesses or brands through the same Workspace account or employee. Users get email addresses at both domains. Users can send and receive email from either address and there's no extra cost per user. Now let's take a look at the other way you can use two domains. Let's say you own the domains solarmora.com and other-company.net. You have one team for solarmora.com and another team for other-company.net. Every person gets their own email address, mailbox, and Google Drive files, some using at solarmora.com and some using at other-company.net. You purchase a Google Workspace license, some using at solarmora.com and some using at other-company.net. Secondary domain features. Good for managing separate teams and businesses. You have different users for each domain. A user gets a Google Workspace account, email address, and mailbox for their domain. And you pay for each user account that you add to your secondary domain. Here are some tips to get you started. Be sure you can sign in to your domain host. This is usually the company where you purchased your domain name. If you need help changing any of your domain settings, be sure to contact your domain host. Thanks for watching. For more information about adding another domain to your Google Workspace account, visit the Add Multiple Domains or User Alias Domains article in the Google Workspace Admin Help Center.